It's time to transform your health with one of North Carolina's leading authorities on true health. Over the next 30 minutes, you'll learn how to prevent and reverse disease, overcome common health issues, and live to your fullest God-given potential. This is True Health Radio with your host, Dr. Jake Shupe of Freedom Family Chiropractic. Welcome to the show. It's Dr. Jake Shupe with another episode of True Health Radio and... I want to take a, a moment and explain why I call this show True Health Radio. If you take a look at the medical system today, you've got, and, and we're here in the Triangle area in North Carolina, you've got Duke Hospital, you've got UNC Healthcare, Wake Med and Rex Hospitals. And when you look at Western medicine and the type of quote unquote health care that they deliver with medications, drugs, injections, and surgeries, can you really call that health care? I don't think that you can because if you take more and more medications, are you gonna be are you gonna be healthier taking more medications or are you gonna be a sicker person? You're gonna get sicker. In fact, most people, the more medications you're on, the sicker that you're gonna get. So our model today, this healthcare system, is really crisis care or a, an emergency care system that people are going to to try to get healthier. And unfortunately, it's just not working when you want to build health. So the principles that I teach on this show, it's all about spreading God's principles of health and healing to the world, teaching you how to do it naturally and heal your body from the inside out. And that's why I call it True Health Radio. And today's topic that I'm excited to to go into is digestive problems and gut health. So let me start off by asking you this question. Are you pooping every single day? Well, A lot of people don't know that you are supposed to have a regular bowel movement every single day. And a lot of patients come into my office and I'll I'll ask them, you know, they come in with neck pain or back pain or headaches. And and when I go over x-rays with them, I'll ask, hey, are you going to the bathroom every day? And a lot of times they're surprised, but it has such a big impact on your immune system and your overall well-being. And you should, most people don't know that they should be going every single day on a regular basis. And did you know 80% of your immune system is in the gut? Well, it is. And and you got all sorts of different symptoms. Maybe you're not going to the bathroom every day, so you're dealing with constipation, uh, diarrhea, bloating. People get a lot of stomach ulcers, uh, more severe issues. More severe digestive issues are going to be like irritable bowel syndrome or Crohn's disease. Those are also like autoimmune conditions. And one of the other most common ones that I see is acid reflux issues. So maybe that's you. Any of those things that I just listed off, if if you're dealing with, with those symptoms or if you know somebody that does, then this show is going to be for you. So you got... A, some sort of a digestive problem. Maybe you're not going to the bathroom regularly, or maybe you're getting heartburn frequently after meals. Well, what do people turn to? What do what do people do? How have we been 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 trained per se to take care of these problems? Again, most people run to the medicine cabinet. So, different laxatives and acids. One of the most common ones that I see is a meprazol which is like your your acid reflux medication. There's all sorts of name brand ones for that, but they are not benign. A lot of times people think that just because a medication is an over-the-counter medication that they're safe, but there's a laundry list of side effects. And uh, if we have time today, I'm going to go into some of the side effects at the end of the show to some of these meds, but most people will will take a medication. And the question I always ask is, is the medication getting to the root cause of the problem? And the answer is no. It, it's not getting to the root cause of the problem. Is the lack of a medication in your bloodstream the cause of a symptom? <laughs> Obviously not. So let's ask ourselves what's causing it. 
And what if I told you that your digestive problems were coming from a problem in your spine? What do you think most people would think of you? Like somebody just came up to you and said, hey, yeah, your digestive issues are coming from a problem in your spine. Most people might think you're crazy. But let me tell you that not only is it possible, it's very, very common. The nerves in, the, in your upper neck supply the, the speed of your digestive tract. The nerves in your mid back go directly into your stomach. Uh, the nerves in your lower back supply the intestines and the colon. And so how does this work? Your brain has to be able to send all the proper messages down your spinal cord across the nerves to your digestive organs. So why am I talking about the spine? Well, your spine houses and protects your spinal cord and those nerve roots. So the proper alignment of your spine directly affects your organ function, including the digestive tract. Get this. The research from a medical journal in 2009 showed that 71% of patients with digestive problems who received spinal adjustments or chiropractic care experienced an improvement in their digestive symptoms, 71%. And 45% of the patients uh, that had the digestive issues were able to reduce or eliminate their digestion medication. And people often wonder how chiropractic helps. Well, it's when you adjust the spine, it removes this nerve system interference to allow your brain to heal your gut, to heal the digestive system the way that it was designed to function in the first place. So if that's you, if you're dealing with digestive problems right now, or if you get chronic heartburn or you're not going to the bathroom, don't waste another minute dealing with just taking drugs for it or just, you know, just going through the day and just having these symptoms continue Give us a call, come into the office, and we're going to help you find a natural solution to these digestive issues. So if you give us a call, we'll set up an appointment, and I'm going to meet with you in the office. And I'll do a full spine exam, consult, plus any necessary x-rays. And normally that appointment in the office, it's $110. But if you call now, if you call from the radio right now, it's going to save you 50 bucks. It's just going to be 60 for the whole first appointment. And we'll find an answer to these digestive issues and, and really find a solution for you. So here's the number. Write this down. Give us a call. It's 984-444-8952. It's 984-444-8952. If you want to look us up online, our website is freedomfamilychiro.com. And you can check out all our awesome testimonials and, and our website and the type of office we are. You can also schedule that appointment online if you'd like. That number that I gave out, uh, you can call or text that number. So you can schedule your appointment through text. If you get the voicemail, don't hang up. Leave your name and number, and I'll get back to you right away, and I'll help you get that set up and answer any other questions that you have. A lot of people don't realize the importance of the spine when it comes to organ function. Chiropractic spinal adjustments improve digestion function by reducing this interference to the nerve system. When your spine it has a misalignment or this, this vertebrae that's shifting, that's called subluxation. Subluxation, it produces stress in the nerve system that it oftentimes decreases blood flow to these vital organs and decreased blood flow will absolutely reduce normal bowel motility. So uh, that can often lead to a slow digestive tract and digestive imbalances. They always produce a negative long-term impact on your health. Again, because so much of your immune system lies within the digestive tract. Digestive issues are one of the most common improvements that my patients will tell me about. But it's funny because 
it's usually not the one that they put down on their paperwork. So, you know, you're being a chiropractic office, people will come in and neck pain, back pain. Yet I have all these other symptoms on the paperwork that are on there because the nerves control everything. But people oftentimes just put neck pain and back pain and leave all the other stuff blank. But after they start care and they're getting adjusted, then I find out like two weeks later, hey, doc. So, yeah, you might, I mean, my neck pain is doing better, which is great. But, hey, I, I got to tell you, uh, my, I've been going to the bathroom more regularly lately. And I'm like, yeah, absolutely. Chiropractic has a, a huge benefit. And then I look at their file. I'm like, yeah, but, John, you, you didn't put that one down on your paperwork. And he's like, well, I didn't know that this was something that could even help with it in the first place. And absolutely it can. And just shared some of the research there. I want to share this story. One of the cutest little girls that ever came into my office, she, her name was Mariah. She's, only, she's eight months old. Parents brought her in and she wasn't colicky baby. She wasn't crying. She, she didn't have any pain or anything, but she was only having a ball movement about every two to three days. And a lot of people think that chiropractic is not safe for children or babies. I think that's because they think that it's like this, some violent treatment or you see this big, you know, 300 pound linebacker getting adjusted and the amount of force that is required to adjust a spine that large is not the same amount of force that you used to adjust an eight month old baby. Let me tell you. So it's very gentle, often using your fingertips or your thumbs to adjust the baby's spine. And it takes a very small amount of pressure to realign that spine and get them functioning properly. Well, that's what Mariah's parents did. They brought her in and sure enough, there was restricted motion and, and subluxation in two areas of her spine. When you're that young, you know, oftentimes there's, there's no need to get x-rays taken. So we got her adjusted. Sure enough, after her very first adjustment, mom comes back two days later, happy as heck, because Mariah, after she left, uh, had a, an extremely large bowel movement, and she's getting she's going to the bathroom regularly every single day, and especially babies, because they're usually going two, three times or more a day, so if, for only a, every two or three days, that's that's not good. Another a uh, story that I want to share is a lady named Pamela. She came into our office like right w after we first opened. And again, she came in with neck pain and back pain. And she was taking Motrin every single day. Not only did she have back pain, but she was only using the restroom once every one to two weeks. I mean, imagine only going to the bathroom once every seven to 14 days. The way that you feel. Uh, the heaviness in your gut, it, it really, that bloating, it, it really affects your your energy and how you feel throughout the day. Well, she comes in, she starts getting adjusted, and not only is her neck pain and back pain gone, she no longer has to take the Motrin for that, but now Pamela's happy as heck because she's going to the bathroom every single day on a regular basis. If that's you, if you can relate with this story, if you've got a loved one, that is dealing with constipation or any type of digestive issue, getting a full spine evaluation is definitely your next step. So give us a call, come into the office, I'll meet with you, I'll do an exam, consult, plus any necessary x-rays. If you call now, it's going to save you $50 off of your first appointment. It's just going to be 60 for everything. Here's the number, give us a call. It's 984-444. 8952. You can also check us out online at freedomfamilychiro.com and you can call or text that number to schedule your appointment. You can also schedule online at that website that I gave you. And our office, we're only about 10 minutes from downtown Raleigh. We're right in Garner. So if you're in the, the Raleigh area, give us a call. But hey, I'll tell you that we've got patients that travel from all over the area because the type of chiropractic care that we deliver and the results that we see in our office, people are driving from Fayetteville, Goldsboro, Greensboro. So if you want to get well, then give us a call. Again, that number is 984-444-8952. Now, the, the next thing that I want to talk about 
We're going to share a couple more stories, uh, but I want to talk about IBS, irritable bowel syndrome, and acid reflux. Well, one of my one of my favorite stories is a guy that came into our office with his name is Jim. Him and his wife they they were referred to our health breakthrough dinner, and they heard me speak. And Jim had a pinched nerve in his lower back, and so he, he scheduled an appointment. His wife came in; she was having low energy, she was having headaches. So they scheduled an appointment to come into the office, and. He wanted help with his lower back, but Jim had struggled with irritable bowel syndrome for probably the last decade. And if you know anything about IBS, it is it can be completely uh, unexpected. Like you don't know when you're going to have to run to the bathroom and you can get very not only stomach pains, but. You can get like bloody stools and it really just throws off any type of planning that you want to do because you don't know when you're going to have to run to the bathroom. And on top of that, that can cause a lot more stress. Well, Jim comes into the office. He, we do his exam and we find severe loss of range of motion in uh, his, his lower back. And there was pressure on his nerve scan. So we got x-rays taken and sure enough, there's damage in the lumbar spine, and those are the nerves that not only go into the back muscles, which will cause back pain, but those are the nerves going into the digestive tract. So that's why a lot of times people will ex- not only come in with back pain, but also digestive issues because those areas are directly related to each other. Well, he comes in. Him and his wife, Lori, start getting adjusted. Her headaches go away. She's super happy. Her neck pain goes away. Jim's lower back pain starts improved. And then about four to six weeks into care, Jim's bowel movements start getting more regular. And he doesn't have to run to the bathroom four, five, six times a day anymore. And then they realize the impact on the digestive system. And then they start following the advanced nutrition plan that I gave them. So they start changing their diet that catapulted it to the whole next level. And together they've lost over 40 pounds. And here we are over a year later, uh, him and his, his wife and his, his granddaughter come into the office and Jim has now completely reversed irritable bowel syndrome. And I think that's a super big deal because the medical profession today says that irritable bowel syndrome is an incurable disease. So these are the types of things. And this is not a super uncommon thing that happens because when you remove the interference to the body and you allow the body to do what it was designed to do in the first place, you can see miracles happen. So if you can relate with that story, if you've been dealing with digestive problems or or irritable bowel syndrome, and you don't want to take medications, give us a call right now and schedule your first appointment in the office. And I want to give you that number. It's 984-444-8952. Or you can look us up online. Our website is freedomfamilychiro.com. That number you can call or text. If you get the voicemail, don't hang up. Just leave your your name and number and I'll get back to you as soon as possible to help set up your appointment so that we can really find out what's causing the digestive issues and develop a plan for a natural solution for you. Acid reflux is probably, besides constipation, acid reflux is one of the most common things that I see in the office. And is something that, you know, you get the fluids from the stomach come up into the esophagus and it could cause like a burning sensation. And prolonged acid reflux can lead to esophageal cancer because that acid deteriorating those tissues long term and those cells have to adapt and it can often cause esophageal cancer if it's if it's untreated. Well, uh, another patient came into the office, acid reflux, heartburn. His name was William. And 
William, when he came in, I did his his exam just by running my hand all the way down his spine. I found that there was a severe scoliosis going on in his lower back. We had to get the x-rays taken and sure enough, he's got like over a 15 degree, I think it was like a 20 degree scoliosis in his lower back, very significant curve, which of course it was causing him a lot of lower back pain. Well, he told me that he was having acid reflux as well. So he starts getting adjusted and you more than likely are not going to completely correct a 20 degree scoliosis. You can start to reduce it or improve it, but that baby's probably not going completely away after being there for that long, but you can really help with it. And so he starts getting adjusted and his lower back pain starts improving. And then after his first progress evaluation, he told me that his acid reflux was gone. Well, the reason I'm telling you that story is because he came in just a couple of days ago and he's been in maintenance care, getting adjusted once a week for several months now after he completed his corrective phase. Well, he had kind of fallen off track a little bit recently and he missed some of his adjustments and he told me the other day that his acid reflux started coming back and I said well let, let's look at your your schedule here and sure enough he had fallen off track with some of his adjustments so he wasn't getting adjusted regularly and and I pres- I recommend a lot of specific spinal exercises for my patients as well to do at home to help keep your spine healthy throughout the week when you're not getting adjusted well I'm guessing he wasn't probably doing some of the spinal exercises while he was out of town or missing some of his adjustments. And then sure enough, he tells me that his acid reflux came back. And I said, we're going to get you back on track, get him adjusted. Now his acid reflux is already improving again too. So if you're wondering if chiropractic can help with more than just neck pain or back pain, it absolutely has a direct impact on organ function, including digestive health, And if you're looking for a natural solution to improving your digestive tract, improving your immune system, and not having to take dangerous medications with terrible side effects that you don't want to have to deal with, give us a call right now to schedule your first appointment in the office. I'll meet with you, do the exam, the consult, plus any necessary x-rays. And if you call now, it's going to save you some money. So don't wait. It's going to save you $50 off the first appointment. It's just going to cost you 60 for the entire uh, evaluation. And I'm going to get some answers for you. And you're going to be able to know what's causing the problem and what you can really do about it. So that number is 984-444-8952. You can also check us out online at freedomfamilychiro.com and help find a solution that'll work for you. Some of the medications that people are taking today are not so benign. They are just, I've I've mentioned this before, but just because something is an over-the-counter medication does not mean that it is safe. So um, I'm going to take a next couple of minutes here to go over some of the symptoms or side effects of these medications. So when people have constipation, they take a laxative. And laxatives are, some of the side effects are electrolyte and mineral mineral imbalances, so causing nutrition deficiencies, severe dehydration, and get this, chronic constipation. Well, why is that? Because you become laxative dependent, so your body, when you take laxatives so often, it's forcing you to have a bowel movement and your body is not using its internal intelligence, its inborn intelligence to create that bowel movement itself and that that nervous system um, memory in that it, it forgets how to work properly. So when you stop taking the laxatives, it can actually cause even worse constipation afterwards if you're not careful. Other side effects from laxatives are internal organ damage and increased risk of colon cancer. So laxatives are not the safest bet either. Omeprazole or Prilosec, these are your heartburn medications. So you've got, listen to this, swelling of the face, swelling of the lips, tongue and throat, hives, difficulty breathing, 
from like an allergic reaction, dizziness, confusion, uneven heart rate, uh, muscle weakness, muscle cramps, and jerking muscle movements, including seizure. That's an over-the-counter medication. So if you don't want to deal with those things, don't be taking the medications. And why do I talk about medications so much on this show? It's because the medications are often causing worse problems than just dealing with the digestive issue itself. And hey, I am not for just ignoring problems and just going on with life like the old guy who's just like, I hate doctors and I'm never going to doctors. But you know what? A lot of times that guy actually is going to end up with better health than the person who just starts to take all these medications because the side effects are so bad today. You've got to find a way to avoid medications, but don't neglect your problem. Find out what's causing it. Get a natural solution and allow your body to heal from the inside out the way that it was designed to in the first place. And that's why we exist. That's why we're here. Give us a call. Freedom Family Chiropractic. We can help you with your digestive issues. This is the number. It's 984 444 Eight nine five two. You can also check us out online at freedomfamilychiro.com. I hope you enjoyed another episode of True Health Radio, and we'll see you guys next week. Thanks for listening to True Health Radio with Dr. Jake Shupi of Freedom Family Chiropractic. Call to schedule your appointment now at 984-444-8952. That's 984-444-8952.